so this is my current project tank. Uh, it was acquired off a colleague. Um, it was a raw timber frame. Uh, it's been painted uh, matte black. It also didn't have support structure. Uh, so I added three timber supports uh, and a rear structural support. Um, measurements are 91 centimeters by 45 by 45. Uh, makes it about 180 liter gross uh, with substrate. Uh, at the moment, it is uh, just over 10 kilos of crushed coral. Uh, and stones, it comes out to about 160 litres. Um, it's cycling at the moment, and there's about four bronze quarries. Uh, just little guys. Um, and it's being heated by a very large 300 watt Eheim Jaeger. Um, uh, it's set at 25 degrees, and it keeps it around 25 pretty well. Uh, I always overheat, so though it is a 180 litre tank, 160, uh, there's 300 watt to overheat, so it keeps a constant temperature. Uh, it's got river rock, uh, made some caves. It's going to be some goby cichlids, hopefully, when the tank is cycled. Uh, I'm going to add some rubble field down the back there. Uh, the tank came with a very very old Aqua 1 fluorescent tube light. Uh, 30 watt each bulb. There's two bulbs. Uh, current filter is a cheap eBay find. Uh, it's about 2200 litres an hour. It's a Hopar 2200 litre. Um, comes with a 9 watt UV bulb. Um, it's currently filled with two layers of ceramic noodles, uh, a layer of purigen and activated carbon, and top layer is just filter floss, manual manual filter. Um, light is on a cheap digital timer. Uh, it's roughly 12 hour light cycle. Um, all in all, it's a lovely tank. Um, I add API Quick Start, Ammo Lock. Uh, I also use their water conditioner and aquarium salt. Uh, I also dose with uh, Seachem plant food. Um, just trying to get some algae to grow. I'll pop some photos of building the stand in the process. Uh, there's also a hood, but I'm having trouble getting hinges to go on it. Um, but all in all, a lovely tank. Thanks for watching.